Hi everyone, I'm Carrie Ann and we I'm the choreographer of Six and I'm here with Playbuild to teach you the final chorus of Six. Choreographing Six has been amazing. I'm so pleased that Toby and Lucy gave me the chance to do so. Um, I think the thing that really drew me to it was the fact that it's an all-woman show. Like, I love the fact that we have six lead principles. I love the fact that we're talking about women's history, women's stories, and kind of rewriting everything. Um, and the music just gives me so much to work with. They did it so well. Um, so I feel like I'm able to get a little kind of melting pot of everything there choreographically. The movement of six, I wanted to make sure that there was like a different palette for each queen. So each queen has got such a different story, uh, such a different history with Henry and so many different mannerisms within themselves that I wanted to make sure that we weren't looking at the same picture six times. So. Um, for example, with Catherine of Aragon, there's quite like a Spanish feel in the music. There's a little bit of a housey feel. So within the choreography, we've kind of got a little bit of those elements. Whereas with Berlin, we go much more for kind of like a rock element. So uh, we're able to kind of like pull on a few different strings. So you ready? We're going to learn the final chorus of six with our lovely alternates, Courtney and Mallory. Okay, everyone, I hope you're warmed up, ready to go. So that, like I said, this is the final chorus of six. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our right arm up, left arm is gonna be behind the back, and we've just got our finger out this way. And we're gonna take the arm back eight times. So your elbow's gonna come forward, the right finger's gonna go back, and we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But as you do that, we're gonna do a little jump on the balls of the feet as well. So just make sure your knees are nice and soft, and the arm is going back at the same time as yourself hitting the floor. So we're going six, seven, eight, we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then from here, we're gonna step out with the right foot and we're gonna make a fist with this right hand, very kind of like cheerleader. And we're gonna pop our left hand onto our hip at the same time. So from here, we're stepping out to the right one. And if you can see our hips are going ever so slightly to the right, then we're gonna go over to the left and we're just gonna bend this hand over your head. And we're going to keep doing that motion for another eight counts. So if you just get used to kind of almost like wagging your tail and then just taking the arm over and above your head, just like you were waving a flag. So we're gonna do eight of those as well. So we've just finished the jumps here, six, seven, eight. We step out, change the arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's join those two things together. Are you ready? Feet underneath you, we go six, seven, eight. We go one of a kind. Five, six, seven, and two. Many years of five, six, seven, and. Hope you got that so far. So from here, this arm is gonna remain. Let's just bring the feet together slightly. In the show, we do a lot of things related around sort of like crowns, obviously, with it being the queendom. So all I want you to do is take your little finger and put it at the front of your head and your thumb and kind of put it around the back and you're gonna spike your fingers in between. So your kind of wrist is a little bit piped, if that makes sense. So once you've got the idea of that shape, we're actually going to use that as an arm going out. So it's kind of, if you get that shape, then you'll sort of be able to see what the arm's doing out to the side. And this arm, so it will actually be over your head. It's never actually gonna go onto your head, that was just for you to get the shape. From here, we're gonna go out, come into the shoulder, out, come into the shoulder, and then we're gonna do one final swoop down and up to a nice sort of high V, yeah? So that is gonna be going on free to take our crown in glory. So I keep going to my crown, don't go to your crown. Well, you can go to your crown whenever you like, but not in this choreo. From here we go, free to take our crown in glory here, yeah. The feet are gonna go from our little tail wag here. We're just gonna go step to the right, pull in your left foot, step to the left, pull in your right foot, repeat the same thing again. So there's this nice kind of like drag feeling. You can use the hips, you can make it kind of as swimmy and as draggy as you like. So when we step out, that's when the arm's gonna be going to the side. So we've just finished our hip wags. We're over to the left hand side. 
we step on the right. This is going free to take our crowning glory for, then when we say five more minutes, very simple, we make a five with the right hand, we're gonna bring this foot together and we're gonna bounce four times, but the bounce, rather than just going down, is gonna actually kind of push a little bit back and a little bit forward. So the pelvis and knees are coming forward and the upper body is kind of going a little further back. Careful that you don't just do it with the upper back because that would be a little bit too much strain there. So from here, we've just taken the arm all the way up. Let's join the bounces and the five together. We go five more minutes. Then the last little piece of the choreo, we take the right hand, uh, right hand behind, right leg behind, and we're going right, left, right hand. So we kind of make like a superhero pose at the end. So let's just go back to five more minutes. We go five more minutes. Knit. We go right, left, right hand, and then imagine, it won't do this in the song, but imagine there's a we're six, and we're going to just hold one little beat, and then we're going to do the famous superhero punch at the end, and we're going to punch our right hand up in the air, left hand's just going to come down this way. So you finish nice and strong in that little diagonal line, yeah? Should we try the whole thing? Woo! Okay. <laughs> Ready? We're warm, we're warm, we're getting there. So let's go from the jumps, that goes into the little flag wave above your head, that goes into the out and in reaches, and then we have the little pump on five. You got this, ready? So you got six, hand behind, seven, eight, one, of a kind, five, six, seven, we go out two, many years, lost in his story, we go free to take, our crowning glory for five more minutes. Right, left, right, hit, we go out. Yeah, how was that? You got it? I think you should see these people dancing it. <laughs>